Hi, good morning, Anna, and let's talk about Siebel 8.2.2 state model enhancements today. I'm going to go to the administration application state model screen and illustrate two very interesting new features. I've created a state model to demonstrate. This state model is operating on the status field of service request to limit the choices an end user can make. I have created four states. The first thing you will notice is that in the state list there is also a category list, or rather each state can belong to a category. These arbitrary categories can be crea created by administrators and used to define transitions. Creating a transition could be as simple as choosing a from category and a to category. This will allow administrators who have much larger numbers of transitions to quickly build a state model. I'm going to delete that now. The second change is the no invoke method property, which allows us to parametrically disable a method when a state is active. I've chosen create case, so for my example, I'm going to go to service requests, service request list, and create a new service request. Its current status is open. You will notice in the form applet here there is a create case button, which is the create case method trigger. When I switch to the close status, the button is no longer active. Very easy, zero code, nice and simple. That's all for today. Hope you have a good one. Speak to you later. Bye bye.